Hey everybody, hope all is well. Thought I'd do a little bit of a special video here. I've had this acetate for a while now and I, I almost forgot about it, but was putting records away uh, a couple of days ago and stumbled across this. I picked this up at Goodwill. Uh, this was a, a $1 fine with a bunch of uh, 78 RPM records. But what this is, is an original acetate that was pressed on April 15th, 1939 at the Worcester Sound Recording Company in Worcester, Massachusetts at 311 Main Street. And what I think we're about to hear, th this is actually recorded on both sides. And remember this name, Joan Lundquist, because Joan happened to also drop off this 78 RPM, which clearly isn't Swedish. And I think Joan's husband or brother, his name is on the other side. We'll listen to both sides. I doubt this is going to violate any uh, copyright, but you never know. Uh, the best I can see, this is Halsa Don Daz by Joan Lundquist. Again, recorded April 15th, 1939. I made an attempt to clean both sides. I'm not going to tell you how I cleaned it, uh, so I don't get any comments that I'm doing it all wrong. But I cleaned it as best as I could. Maybe we're about to listen to this for the first time in almost 80 years. Uh, if my mom was alive today, I'm sure she'd get a kick out of this, but we've got the Grundig console open, the Grundig uh, musical instrument console, and we're going to play this back at 78 RPM, see how it sounds. So, hope you enjoy the first part of this video. Man, 
Okay, so we heard who could be Joan Lundquist. We heard a male announcer at the beginning. We're on the other side now, and this is from Herbert Lundquist in some Swedish that I cannot read or interpret. I'm wondering if anybody watching this video knows Swedish or even knows the Lundquist uh, of Worcester. Uh, again, recorded at Worcester Sound Recording Company, Worcester, Mass., 311 Main Street, on April 15th, 1939. So we'll listen to the second side and see what we hear. Okay, so I'm thinking we heard that recording maybe for the first time in just about 80 years. And if anyone watching this recording maybe e either knows who the Lundquists are in the city of Worcester, Massachusetts, or if they know Swedish and can maybe steer me uh, towards what these songs are, what they mean, uh, clearly recorded uh, before the United States entered uh, World War II, uh, coming from 1939. And I think we just heard a little piece of recording history. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, all, all I'll say about uh, what I used to clean, I did not use alcohol. You cannot use alcohol on acetate. So. Uh, again, I hope you enjoyed this video. Take care for now.